Hey guys, I'm going to show you how you can make a flat lay video all from your phone and you don't need any fancy cameras, tripods, or computers. All you do need is your phone, obviously. Um, you need a chair, a book, and my free stop motion video app, Life Labs. Um, you're gonna create a new project and before we start shooting the flat lay video we have a couple housekeeping items to do here um, so we're gonna lock the exposure the white balance and the orientation of the camera because we don't want lots of flickering light and colors throughout your video so whether you want to shoot vertical or horizontal and the reason for this is when you hold life flaps up it'll detect by whatever way you're holding it which way it goes the problem is when you lay it flat down the camera's kind of unsure of which way you want to shoot. And I held it upright like this to get the first shot to lock the vertical mode into place. So for me, I chose the wall near the window where I'm going to be shooting my flat lay. Um, it has some white in it. I'd always recommend getting a neutral color in there so that your white balance can be set properly. And the exposure is similar because it's near the window. On the note of exposure, if you are shooting by a window and you plan to be a couple minutes or longer shooting the video, look outside. Is it constantly forecasted or constantly sunny? If so, you're probably good to continue shooting there. Um, if it's sun and clouds and the exposure is changing a lot outside because the sun is out one second and then it's behind the clouds, um, your video might look flickering, flickery with the lighting because um, it's going in and out of the clouds. I'd recommend if this is the case, go to a very controlled lighting environment. Um, maybe you have a spotlight or like a kitchen light, you can just pop the flat light under that and that we have full control over the situation. So now that we have that taken care of, now the fun begins. You're gonna get your chair and your book. Um, the reason why you need the book is because when you place the phone just on the chair, you might get the legs of the chair in it, depending on what chair you have. So I just got my Minimalist Baker favorite recipe book, and you put it on top, and then you place your phone over the edge, and that way you don't see the legs of the chair. For me, I always like to use colorful Bristol boards for my flat lays. I also have like a fake marble countertop that I use. Bristol boards, you can just buy those at the dollar store, your local craft store. Um, the countertop was actually left over from a bathroom renovation that I did. There's actually a fourth housekeeping item that we need to do and that's to set your timer. And the reason why we need the timer is so that you can focus on moving the objects and not constantly going back to your camera to take the pictures. And another reason is not only the inconvenience of having to go do it, is each time you push it, you might move the camera around a little bit, and this will affect the flat lay, because you don't want the background moving at all. You want just the objects, and if you move your camera around, um, this will impact the whole video. So I put my timer on for 10 seconds, and you need to activate both timers at the top of the camera. Um, if you activate just the one on the very far left, it means it'll just take one picture 10 seconds from now. When you activate both, it means it'll take a picture every 10 seconds, and this is what you want. I ended up having to change the length of time because I had so many items to move that I changed it to 20 seconds apart. Um, you might also want to change your display on your phone if it dies or dulls down after 30 seconds of you not touching it. Um, I'd recommend changing that as well. So my motion for this flat light, it's going to be the objects that are going to come in, and then we're gonna have the Hawaiian Tropic move around. So maybe you're an influencer and you have one product you wanna highlight for a sponsored post. This would be a cool idea for you to just have the one object moving so it really pops out. So now that you have all that housekeeping out of the way, it's now time to get creative and start animating your flat lay and bring it to life with video. So to do this, you have everything set to go. You take your first picture without anything in the frame or depending on what you want to animate. Maybe your object is already in the frame and you just want to move one thing around or multiple things around. Um, essentially, you take the picture, you move your object a little bit, wait for the next picture to take, move it, rinse and repeat. So depending on how many objects you have in your video, um, it'll depend how long it'll take you. Me personally, for this one, it took me under three minutes to create. For the iOS version of Life Labs, we do have a new feature called the boomerang. Um, and basically, it's exactly how it sounds. You animate something and then it will reverse it. So for me, the products, they come in, the Hawaiian Tropic shakes, and now I don't have to manually make them exit because the boomerang effect will just have it go out on its own. So now that you have the animation done, you can open it up in the player. 
Now when you play it right away, you're gonna notice, one, it's really slow, and two, maybe the boomerang effect isn't enabled. So this is where you have fun, you can change the ratio, add some music, filters, um, and then change the speed. If you want it to look in real time, meaning like real standard 24 frames a second, um, crank that speed about 75% to the right. Alright, I hope you guys found this tutorial useful. Um, I really look forward to seeing your flat lay videos on social media. Uh, you can hashtag lifelaps or tag us at, at lifelaps underscore app. Um, give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and if you have any questions, comments, or you want to see a new tutorial, um, please comment below or DM us on any social media platform. I respond to all channels. Oh, 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 oh,